Hi guys and welcome to my channel. Um, so basically I'm going to Disney in two weeks today, which I cannot wait. Countdown has been on forever. Um, so we're going as a celebration of my end of treatment and all my family members are going with me. So I thought it'd be a fun idea to take everyone along with the ride with me. So today I'm going to start off with a clothing haul because um, I thought that'd be a fun idea. So I've got some clothes next to me in a box here, got some accessories and like bits and bobs that I'm taking with me. Um, I've also got shoes, bags, like hats and that over there. But because we are going for Halloween, because Halloween is my favourite time of year, uh, I've also, we're going to the Mickey's Not So Scary Halloween party. So I also have a Halloween costume. So I've got that to show you later as well. So let's get to it. <laughs> Most of my clothing I got in Primark, New Luck, Super Dry, or online basically. That's where I shop mostly. <laughs> so to start off with, as they are on the top, I have got my pyjamas. I do have another pair of 90s, but they are in the wash right now. So this is the first, just a little cute vest top, red polka dot, got Mickey Mouse, and pair of shorts to go with it which also have Mickey Mouse. Spoiler alert, I think I've only got about 10 items that has not got Disney on them so you're gonna hear Mickey Mouse and Minnie Mouse a lot in this video. Um, let's go start off with the shorts. Got a lot of pair of shorts, went a little bit overboard. So first of all I've got just a pair of denim ones, they're all tassely, got some rips and some flowers stitched onto them. I've got also from same sort of style but these are a bit shorter and they've also got flowers and or little badges stitched onto them. These are from Super Dry, same as the other ones. Um, also got, it's kind of hard, hard to show you the detail on them. It's sort of like knitted type of material and it's just got little flowery bits stitched at the bottom. There you go, that's a bit better if you'd be able to see. These were £3 in Prima. Um, I've also got a wide range of shorts, just the little comfy material shorts you get from Primark. And I believe they were all £4 each. So first of all I got a Winnie the Pooh pair. I just got a little photo of Winnie the Pooh and Honey written on them. Chuck them down there. I've also got Thumper pair. Which again have the word Thumper and a picture of Thumper on there. A Mickey Mouse red pair and a Minnie Mouse black pair. So these are just really comfy shorts to be able to chuck on. That's why I got a couple of pairs. We go um something that is not Disney that I have is my super dry top. I love this top when I saw it, so it is a long sleeve top for a bit more of the chillier days out there. But most days out there are going to be hot. I got a little Mickey Mouse top from Primark which was £5. I got a Dumbo top from Primark which this was actually gifted to me for Christmas because we've been planning this trip for a while so a lot of people have just bought me some nice things. So that's Dumbo from Primark and I also had this one gifted to me as well which is another Winnie the Pooh just a little oversized top. Um, from Primark as well I also bought some vests so I'm not going to show you all the vests they all look the same this is a pink one which is kind of hard to see in the light but it is just a light baby pink one but I also have a I have two black ones as well to go with that I have some more tops <laughs> I have a retro looking Disney one which has got Pluto, Goofy, Donald Duck and Mickey Mouse on it. 
crop top just like the pattern on it I got this crop top as well which is just striped plain striped from Primark which is four pound and this white one with just little Winnie the Poohs falling over and running I've got a cold so please just bear with me um, some of these are dresses, some of these are play suits, I've got a mixture. So this is a little play suit, which is off the shoulder and a pair of shorts. This was from New Look and it was £15. Um, I got a denim all-in-one in khaki colour, which is also, which was from Primark, which was £20. Uh, I got a nice little play suit, just really frilly for the nice warm days, just really loose. This is a dress, and this was £12 from Select. And I got a dress which is polka dot, it's a long dress which will go down to the floor. And I got this from New Look for £10. <laughs> I've also got the last denim one, which I have opened up. Just little buttons, they pop together and then you just tie it around your waist. This was from New Look and I believe this one was £26. I've taken the tag off it because I've tried it on and wore it. <laughs> obsessed with socks and I'm sure people out there feel the same as I do I love buying new socks so I bought Disney socks because where else better to wear Disney socks than Disney and plus it gave me an excuse to buy more socks um, these are again are from Primark or New Look so I got some cute little Bambi ones from Primark I had these gifted to me but they're normally around about £2.50 for anyone wondering. I know Primark have just come out with a new range of Disney socks, so these ones may not exactly be there. Um, I've also got, sticking with Primark, I bought something that isn't Disney, uh, but I bought the Arch Support Gym Workout socks that are trainer socks because there is so much walking that we are going to be doing. So, want to support my feet? Um, these ones from New Look. I bought Friends ones because I am obsessed with Friends as well. <laughs> Although it's not Disney, I just wanted the socks. And Joey does not share food because that is a relatable line. And I felt like I needed it on my socks. And last but not least, just a pair of Disney Minnie Mouse head shorts. And they were all three for six pound so although new look ones are more expensive than pre-mark uh, I feel like they are really soft and nice quality for anyone who's wondering that the little bits and bobs I have so I have a bikini bag which was a pound just to put my bikinis in if they get wet or to travel them around with and I don't want any the rest of my stuff in my case being wet or in my backpack got that so now into a bit more of the accessory type I have got a little mini purse because my backpack is only quite small to go into the parks which I'll be showing later um, so I only want the little purse to be able to chuck some notes in and some coins right now I have some dollars already in there ready to go um, and I believe this was three pound in Primark so it wasn't that expensive um, I also got two pairs of sunglasses. This one just little sunglasses got little palm trees on, which I thought were really cute. Once again, I got these in the sale, so this was two pound. And this pair, which has got little flips at the end, were only a pound, and they are baby pink. Uh, I got some earrings got a couple of packets of earrings um, I got 
these Disney ones, which are silver Mickey Mouse and Minnie Mouse heads. I got some gold ones then, which have Mickey Mouse, a bow and a flower. And then I got some Halloween ones since we're out there for Halloween, which have hearts, black and orange ones. There's a witch's hat. There's ghosts, pumpkins wearing a witch's hat. Ones that say spooky and some other more ghosts. Uh, I also have, which my friend kindly gifted me for my birthday, some Mickey Mouse ones that have diamonds in the middle. So I will be taking them along with me too. Uh, I also bought some lashes, which I'm going to wear when we go out in the evenings. Okay, I've got a couple of you know, just the essential stuff you need, like sun cream and all stuff like that will be going into my parents' suitcase. I bought a after sun lotion because I am ginger, I burn and I don't really want to come back looking like Peppa Pig. So make sure we've got a lot of sun cream and after sun because some days I burn anyway. Um, I also got a hair and scalp spray for the days where I don't wear a hat and I can just protect my head in the water parks, for instance. This is when this will come in handy. I bought these both in Primark on sale again, so they were both a pound each. I also bought a Nivea roll-on, just in kit, so I don't have to take an aerosol out there. I can just pop this in my bag whenever I feel like I need to freshen up then. Just roll it on. This was only a pound, and I think I got it from Bargains. You can get them in any store. There's different packs of these, because they... I can put whatever I want in them, so I have like my eczema cream to take out and I have stuff that I need to wash my nose stud with, all stuff like that. Anything that I don't want to take a massive bottle with, I've got a couple of little plastic reusable ones I can take with me. Uh, I have just my normal makeup but I have bought the Blue Universal Face Primer because as I was watching some other youtubers go there because i like to watch some vlogs and all stuff like that some people recommended this and this so i bought the primer and this is just a spray on moisturizer from vaseline so i also bought these um i bought a couple of phone cases because i couldn't decide which one i want to be honest so i have the Alice in Wonderland one and a Mickey Mouse one which I'll take out the packaging now which this is like a vintage little Mickey Mouse one which I loved so I'll have different phone cases for different days and different outfits um, as we are going to Florida and my suitcase does not have one of those little red buttons i don't really know how to explain it i got told i need to buy one of these so that little red button there apparently you need that on your suitcase so they can't break it open if they think anything suspicious is in your suitcase so got one of these uh i do have a power bank which is disney as well which i got off asos for 10 pound um but that is in my college bag at the moment so i have my lead to go with it because as it's red Got a red lead to go with it too. A lip balm which is tinted and it's also got SPF 15 in it. So that'll be handy as it's hot out there and I don't really want to be wearing lipstick or a lot of makeup so I've just got this which is by Camex. And I got it in the shade Berry. Um, once again as I said I got the little plastic ones. I've also got Dumbo ones, which one's photo Dumbo, one says let's fly, these are from Primark, I think they were about a pound, so they had to, I had to buy them, <laughs> basically. A luggage tag that I got, bought for my birthday, which is Mickey Mouse's, and it's got my name imprinted on it. I also got a couple of bows, I got this one, I've got a red glittery bow, um, and I have a Star Wars bow. 
ready to go. Um, I bought a waterproof foam bag for when we go to the water park so I can still vlog and take some photos while we're there. And then my phone won't get damaged. When we're out there, it is also my brother's birthday. So I have bought little autograph books. This one is my one. And this one is my brother's. They are very good. Um, I bought them on eBay by a person called Jill. As it says on the back of each book, it says book creation by Jill. So you can pick if you're going to Disney World Florida or if you're going to Paris, you can pick the month and the year and what colour you want and you can personalise it for your name. So these were great and I'm pretty sure they're about £9 each so they weren't that expensive. I've actually got the piece of paper still in here. Here you go, here's... Put that on screen for if anyone is interested and I will link it down below. So they are these which I am very happy with. I think that is it on that side for all the little bits and bobs. <laughs> uh, now on to shoes and my bag. So First of all, this is my little backpack that I was talking about earlier. Once again, got this gifted by me from my sister, um, who is also coming to the park with us. So it's just got a zip there. It's only small, as I said earlier, but it's perfect size to fit my phone, my charger, my purse, and just some water in there. That is perfect. I'm bringing four pairs of shoes with me all together. I've got these grey memory foam ones from Primark and these were only £8 so that's very good for gym shoes. Once again gym wear, memory foam so they're nice and soft on my feet as we are doing so many steps. The other pair I've got are white gym shoes but they are from Adidas. I nearly said that wrong. The other two pairs I have are these trainers which have Mickey Mouse and Minnie Mouse on them which I think are really cute. These are from Primark. It's just got Mickey Mouse pulling a funny face and Minnie Mouse looking worried or scared to be honest but I still think they're really cute. I'll be wearing these on the plane out there as they are my heaviest shoes and I want to keep room in my suitcases and wait and then I've got these sandals which have just got rose gold little details on and they're just beige um, I'm very fussy when it comes to sandals don't like things in between my toes like flip-flops so this pair was perfect and I'm pretty sure I got these from shoe zone and they were only about £10 so that shoe is done and last but not least, my Halloween costume, which to me is the most important. For my Halloween costume, me and my family are all dressing up as Disney villains. So for my Halloween costume, me and my family decided we would dress up as Disney villains as we're going to Mickey's Not So Scary Halloween Party. Um, so my favourite film is Alice in Wonderland. So I went as the Queen of Hearts. So I bought a couple of different stuff to make it my own and a little bit more retro-y than the normal Queen of Hearts. So this is my skirt that I bought off eBay. It was £12 I believe, but it's just got yellow, black stripes, black and red as you can see, and it's quite a puffy out skirt. Um, I have got this top which I am obsessed with. I have lots of different versions of them of Alice in Wonderland but they are the twisted tops which is a gothic version of Alice which I'm going to put that as my top with the skirt and then I have a headband which 
I bought just white roses and I have painted red on for painting the roses red in Alice in Wonderland. If anyone wanted to know why I've painted them red. I've also bought little lace gloves to wear and they only come to about my wrist. And then I got knee high socks which just have the playing card signs on the side and they are black and white striped. So I bought all of these, it come to about, because I already had the top, probably about £35, but I think it's a really cute outfit. I'm not too sure what shoes I'm going to wear with it yet, but probably my white ID one. So 